Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to another Pokemon Go video. We finally have the Z-Move update and I'm pretty excited about this, this, all this stuff, to be honest. I have a lot of mixed, well, yeah, I have mixed feelings because I see a lot of people, I really feel bad for all those guys that can't pay on the game, but at the same time, we are well for free to play players are gonna be able to get more figures like well kind of more i would say but the problem is that they won't get the newest figures for the first days at least because my my i think that maybe in one month when they release the next banner will be able to purchase the the new figures through the the gym system you know the the new system where you can buy megas and all those stuff i don't know it's here if you don't know where is it it's here in the special so this is a really good change well th this is a good thing that they added because i mean i think it's really worth it to be honest i used to get one ex out of 500 gems like, most of the time it's, sometimes i used to get two rarely really 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 rare, rare, rarely i got three or more so it's really worth it and you know what is the, the figure that you want so for example Blaziken and Mega Blaziken those guys are just beasts evolved and uh, with Z moves they are really beasts so, so the problem here is gonna be I think and I'm, I think I'm gonna post on reddit something about this because I want to talk with uh, well t uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna. I want to explain why it's not becoming a pay-to-win game. It's just a pay-to, pay-to, to entertain a mechanic. You know, so to get it entertained. That's the thing. So if you wanna have fun with the newest figures. You have to pay. If you don't want, if you don't have to pay, you can have fun. But you have to wait one more month. That's what i think that it will be i hope to be honest because if there's no other way rather other than mats to get the newest figures that's completely bad you know but i hope that this is well yeah this is gonna be my prediction and i hope that it's gonna be good um and now another thing yeah before we start the video to be honest i don't know what the video is gonna be about yeah but I, it's gonna be about my thoughts mainly but i wanted to show to ask you guys do you want me to buy to purchase the the pack the you know the player pass do you want me to purchase it because i'm gonna do it just for the for the content if you tell me no don't don't buy it because we want you to struggle like a free-to-play player i'm not a free-to-play player but uh, i mean i will get the newest figures and i want to see i want to really feel the struggle that's one thing uh so if you want me to like give you some anti-meta decks with the old figures that that will be the path so the the non-player path path you know so let me know if you want me to choose that path or if you want some content with the newest figures so that i will eventually get it i mean yeah we'll get if free to play players players you're gonna get these figures late like yeah at least one of them out of those boxes you know like it's impossible that they are gonna be mainly for for uh, pay to play players you know 
but anyways uh that being said let me know let me know in the comments down below if you want me to purchase the the pack the pass or no like yeah it all depends on you guys uh, i think i'm like to be honest right now i won't i don't want to buy it but if you tell me well i really want to buy it to be honest but if you tell me that you want to see like some content with the old figures like you want to, to make me feel the struggle that's a good idea i mean just let me know i just want it to be for to do it for entertainment purposes i don't really mind if i don't get the newest figures i mean i'm gonna be a little bit bored but nothing will really change because i'm having fun with uh, what i have the z moves are really fun to be honest but let's hope yeah well, let's hope into the match and we'll see what what can we talk about okay so i finally found an opponent wow it took like 15 minutes so it's kind of annoying that i thought that, that it will that the z move of update will bring back other people but i don't think so but anyways let's let's go with the match so as you can see here i'm featuring a new deck with coco which has an incredible z move why i'm gonna explain why because it's a like a four or five star purple which is absolutely amazing against this guy against the best goalie of the game you know so that's why i'm using it then because yeah it, it only moves so the effect of, the, of this thing is to move okay um so yeah it's it basically only moves without weight without anything but good play from his part but yeah it does that and it's it really counters Pikaiger, so that's what I'm using Coco and especially Coco because it's a it's a runner, so he can easily get to the to Pikaiger in like yeah in two moves it can get to Pikaiger, so that's what I decided to use Coco because I could use Dini or or Bulu or Mimikyu yeah I was thinking about Mimikyu because it's a 200 Z move so yeah that's pretty nice okay so let's go with with not the Lucario let's try to get this guy down um, so basically, I really if you saw the new like I really like the effect of the of the psychic Z move, the steel Z move, and then what else the dark Z move? Yeah, that's why I'm using uh, Evelpal and Sableye as well because of the dark Z move, which is absolutely amazing. Um, let's see. Let's go. Let's continue with like a Sam. Perfect. And uh, what else? I, I wanted to say. Uh, yeah. So this deck was basically built because I wanted to to make uh, the best Z to put the best Z moves together. That's why I I thought about this deck. But um, I mean, it's not really good to be honest. I have lost. I think twi twice, yeah. But because of mistakes, yeah, it's not like because of the deck is weak, it's because of mistakes, to be honest. Because okay, because uh, I forgot about the steel type Z move, so I was blocking with two defenders on the goal, and yeah, that I lost instantly because of that. What else? Um, then I lost against some BS origin pools 
that that was beautiful but anyways okay so let's continue attacking um no actually no i'm not gonna attack i'm gonna move forward so this guy is blind so celebi can't move through Ivelto so it's kind of a counter meta deck because celebi is gonna become meta like really strong his entire almost i mean only the background mm, okay is it fairy no it's grass okay so its entire will is very like it's is strong against Dinus. that's the thing that's the, the word yeah it's strong as against Dinus. so that that makes me that makes it really powerful we'll say and then grass knot you know it's so good so if you can see here i have already my zid move and i should have gone for the zid move i'm so dumb i had the game yeah i had the game <sighs> damn it uh, yeah i have the game i i had i just I thought that the Z move wasn't filled, filled enough, you know, I thought that I needed one more turn, that's why I went really, really quick on that. Um, let's go here, perfect, so I'm one move away, I need to survive this roll against Alakasem and um, gonna be game because of the zid of the fairy zid so that i'm showcasing the fairy zid this thing is OP. okay um what's the best thing to do here here um i don't have mega lucar anymore No. I activated the bad Z move. Oh my god. I'm so dumb again. <laughs> oh, what am I I'm even doing? I, I need to get used to it. Oh god. Oh yeah, I, I'm not used to all these Z moves. I forgot. I completely forgot about that about the i thought that it was on the first page but anyways got the dodge clutch super clutch coco you can see damn bro like all those misplays from my part luckily it was absolute so it, it was pretty weak to uh, to be like really move so but yeah that was good okay so i don't know oh I don't know why, why can I, can't I check any figure? I don't know, but that, that was sweet, that was really amazing. So, if you can see, if you're really worrying about the that you won't be able to compete against the new decks because you don't have the newest figures, that's complete, that's not true at all. Well, for the moment maybe someone is gonna come with a with an op strat with the new figures and um, that will be the end of uh, free to play players but i completely doubt it because there's a lot no there's one thing that saves free to play player, players players so if you have at least one uh, yeah i mean this deck if you have Mew, if you have Mew, you can build wh whatever deck you want. Well, not actually the case, but Mew is completely anti-meta right now. So good, and with the psychic thing, the psychic Z move, it can save you matches. When it's GG, when they surround your goalie, 
with the lead move, with the psychic lead move, they can, it can save the game because it hopes over the, I don't know, it's hard to explain but it saves you so it's pretty good, so the still lead move as well, it saves you if you're if you have lost the game for example we have there's uh, your goal is surrounded um so i mean for free to play players the basics to survive right now is are gonna be i think lucario that that will be really good because of the steel z move it's so awesome and it's because it has a purple a decent slice at the slice of purple so really counters all of the zidmoves then Mew the only mon that has 50% chance against any zidmove because there's mons that have a lot of good odds such as Sableye against normal zidmoves but when it comes against um, the new purple lead moves it doesn't survive it doesn't stand a chance well stable uh, yes because it has a gold attack but Mew has a 50% chance on both cases so I definitely recommend it if you don't have Mew I will say you should craft it to be honest like that guy is so good so good then what else Pick Kyogre uh, this guy is a really good goalie, that's the only thing. Uh, it has a good Z move, like the water Z move is completely good. But what can replace Pick Hyre? Um, I would say Kildare with both forms because it has two lives. And then another Lucario. Well, or you use Lucario as a goalie and you put. Blaziken, I don't know, um, or Pop Popio, that's another mod that I need to talk about. Then what else? Um, yeah, so these two guys are just for for fun. Eveltel is... I, I like the buff. I like the buff. If you have him chain level 10, that's completely awesome because you can handle well Haxor, evil Haxorus without change. Uh, without uh, chains yeah so that's pretty awesome and it has a lot of purple so pretty strong against these moves then Coco here um, I'm just trying the fairy Z move which is absolutely amazing I couldn't showcase it because of my lack of concentration you know but um, yes if you have a fairy man, I would say Mimikyu, it's a good idea as well. So it really counters Pick Hyger with the with the Zid move. So I definitely definitely give a shot to fairy mons. I mean, you know, it doesn't give any other thing other thing than than moving the opponent to the bench, even without weight. But it can win you games without that instant move you know so yeah pretty good what else uh, and Sableye I will say it's pretty meta because of all of the Z moves yeah maybe but anyways guys yeah I think it's time to say goodbye another thing that I forgot to say to talk about is the brand new system which is uh, reducing the for one hour each time you play it. So that's pretty awesome. I really like that. And um, so hopefully, maybe they have increased the odds. I don't know, but maybe this system increases. Well, yeah, it obviously increases your odds. So if you're really lucky, you'll eventually get Necrozma. No, I don't know. Well, yeah, the new figures, you may get one of the newest figures. But I don't know if they if they mentioned that they buff the odds of the newest figures for the first days. I don't know about that, but I haven't seen anyone pulling a new figure, so that's pretty bad. But thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I'm really sorry, yeah 
because I haven't been uploading consistently and I apologize. I apologize. I really apologize with that. But thank you guys so much for watching and see you next time. Peace.